more in the few in the last class we discussed the main properties and the sets they are nothing but uh, closure property associated property existence of identity existence of universe and the commutative property by using any composition on the non empty set okay let us discuss very important task about groups that is nothing but special definitions number 1 is a groupoid what is a groupoid which non empty set is saying to groupoid every time we have to consider a non empty set g if this set holding first property that is closure property in order to be read it and they can jumble check and first closure next associativity existence of identity letter in a verse and then commutative property in order to verify the properties if the set all the elements in the set holds the closure property then the set is called groupoid the example is the example is again you may consider n comma dot what is n set of naturals if you consider any two elements to verify a closure property any two elements a as 5 and b as 7 a dot b which is equal to 5 dot 7 which is equal to 35 is it 35 countable number Yes, evidently this is the natural number, so it is belongs to the set N. That's why we are calling that N comma dot is a groupoid. Some more examples are you may give like Z comma plus Q comma dot like that. A set, a non-empty set holding the first property is called groupoid. Next, uh, second one, what is a semigroup? a non empty set with the two properties closure property and associative property is called a semi group if you consider uh, composition is star you want to say that uh, g comma star is a semi group if this satisfies the set satisfies two properties closure property associative property under this composition then we say that it is a semi group give a special example of this semi group n comma dot again n comma dot is a semi group because here already we discussed in the n comma dot the closure property holds similarly we can verify and in n comma dot a dot b dot c value is equal to a dot b dot c for every three elements in the set so we can say that n comma dot is a semi group what is a semi group a non empty set is satisfying two properties closure property associative property is called a semi group next coming to the third one monoid which set is saying to monoid if we add semi group if we add existence of identity property to the semi group semi group ki manam marak property third property existence of identity manam insert chesinatlayite vachche atundi de monoid for example you may consider z comma dot it is a monoid evidently or the n comma dot you may consider because already we verified that in closure property associativity so we can consider n comma dot it is a monoid because here we can say that the multiplicative identity is always one one is in the set of naturals that's why we are calling that a dot e is equal to 1 e is equal to a for all a in n similarly e dot e is equal to a for every a in the set yeah so existent identity exists 
and the n comma dot so n comma dot is a monoid it is a particular example for monoid next very very important definition is that group which set is saying group monoid it satisfies the property for existence of universe that means uh, if the uh, all the elements in the monoid having inverse elements then that uh, set is group okay or on other words you may say that uh, a non empty set g a non empty set g is said to be a group under the composition star if it satisfies closure property associative property existence of identity existence of inverse examples let us discuss them through examples which set is going to set a group is it natural is under uh, multiplication is a group let us discuss it already we said we said that n comma dot is a monoid isn't it now we want to verify the existence of inverse property so we are finding inverse elements suppose 4 is an element in n what is the identity element 1 what is the condition in the existence of inverse property we have to pick up b so that a star b is equal to e and b star a is equal to e out to b and it went the element manu pick up chestu adu tiri man set lo untunda ledha chakcha so a value anedi man 4 kind isthunna 4 star b is equal to 1 star value is here we consider the composition is dot so b value is equal to taking out 1 by 4 identity in identity is 1 that's why we are taken here 1 b value is 1 by 4 is it a natural number it does not belongs to the natural number set so 4 ane element ki 1 by 4 అనేది మల్టిప్లికేటివ్ ఇన్వర్స్ అవుతుంది గాని మన సెట్ లో లేదు గనుక n, డాట్ అనేది నాట్ ఏ గ్రూప్ ఇట్ ఈస్ నాట్ ఏ గ్రూప్ 